Welcome back to New Day. You know sunnier days are coming when store shelves start to fill up with the latest crop of spring shoes. I am almost ready to expose my toes, but if you're looking for comfy shoes that are still fashionable, you've come to the right TV show. Here's stylist Darcy Camden. Good morning. To join us with uh, so many beautiful styles. You always make New Day so fashionable, but now you're making our feet fashionable today. Well, this is sort of a reintroduction to shoes for a lot of us who have been dressing just kind of from the waist up for the last two years. Yeah. I haven't thought about shoes very much yeah. during COVID. And so I really needed to get back out try the trends. Everything I'm talking about today, I wore for a minimum of two days. Wow, so you've tried everything I on this table. The okay. walk. Okay, she's walked a mile in these yeah. shoes, folks. because I know comfort is important. Yeah. And, you know, I wanted to talk about that and not forget that people want to still be comfortable. So, so sandals. No. I actually am ready to expose my toes. I'm not going to lie. Okay, right now? A, well, are you taking your shoes I mean, off? No, I won't yeah. take them off now, but... <laughs> So these are cute. Okay, so this is a trend called the platform sandal, AKA the ugly sandal trend. But I have to say these from Zodiac, which are about $50, really affordable, might be the prettiest of the ugly sandals. Actually, you can tell, like it's a little bit tailored in the front. It isn't that yep. ugly. It has a platform also known as a lug sole. It's really, really comfortable. Good cushioning on the arch and the heel. I like that you could style it. You could wear it with a jean. You could wear it with a sundress. Yes. You could wear it with shorts. So if you were going maybe on a trip, okay. people are having trips again, yeah. this would be a really great shoe to take because you could walk all day yes. and wear it out to dinner. All right. I like that. That's fun. It takes me back to the 90s too. Totally. It's a, it's a super 90s throwback. Okay, <laughs> yeah. another trend that's happening, like it or not, everybody, I know we everyone has different feelings about this, but slippers as shoes. Oh, like I can wear them out? Yeah. I mean, I, I, I have worn them to the grocery store. We're, but like, <laughs> Like to you, Village? In yeah, we're seeing celebrities do it at Fashion Week. People were doing it. Models were running back and forth to the shows in their slippers. So I was sitting with my husband the other night, and we were watching TV, and we're kind of like, "What is that smell?" And we realized it was my disgusting slippers <laughs> that have been through the pandemic and need to go. And so, if you're like me and you need a new I, pair of slippers, I am so grateful to you. New Day stylist Darcy Camden <laughs> talking about her stinky, stinky feet. Stinky feet. I, I love that. So these are from Deer Foams. Okay. They are water resistant, which I love. They have a sole that you can do. It's their indoor outdoor sole. Okay. Really, really comfortable. You might want to order uh, an, a size up just because they're so fluffy, but okay. they're really, they're so much more affordable than other brands. I was going to say, they, their Uggs are super expensive. Under $100 and, and for the I, Deer Foams. Okay, that's ideal in the Great. same material yeah. because I think Uggs yeah. quality has really slipped too. Mm. And you're paying for that and, and you want something that's going to last. So this is These really are nice. They're okay. great. Yep. And you can, if they get wet, fine. Okay. Okay. So another thing, if comfort is important to you, which all of my clients, everyone I meet is like, c comfort is key. Okay. Everyone needs to know about a new shoe store that opened a couple of months ago in, on Seattle's Capitol Hill. It's called Frankie Four. Okay. These shoes. Do you have these shoes? So I have a pair of tennis shoes from them, and they are amazing. Everyone is going nuts for these shoes. Okay. All the fashion girls are wearing what are essentially orthopedic shoes. Right. They were created by podiatrists. <gasps> the insoles of these are so just incredibly supportive. And they give you a couple of choices when you buy the pair, right? You can right? make them wide. Oh, I love so this. So great for alignment, for foot pain. I have been wearing the, I have to tell you, these Oxfords, more comfortable than any tennis shoe I've ever worn. Really? More comfortable than slippers. Seriously, I'm on my feet all day and I've never felt anything more comfortable. Okay. And they really have some great sandals, very Are pretty sandals options. Are sandals comfortable? Because sometimes yes. if they don't move. Oh. Oh. The same podiatrist you, in, like developed I'm, I'm going to try insole. these on real quick. Those are your don't size worry. too. I, my feet aren't that stinky. <laughs> Those are your size. You're going to love them. You're not going to want to take them off. They're amazing. So if you have a wedding that you need to go to this summer and you want something oh. really comfortable, they have heels, they have pretty sandals, great place to go. These are a little big on me, but I mean very comfortable. Oh, they're so good. Okay. You get them back. Next, 
Trend Sustainable Sneakers. So this is a brand, Avery, A-V-R-E. I think it stands for like authentic, versatile, um, responsible, and cool. empowered. What I love about, they're made from recycled water bottles. Okay. They're really, really lightweight. And I love the trend of the no laces. I so you too. just sort of slip it on really easy to go. I don't got go. time for laces. Yep. Okay. And so like I will wear these for part of the day. Okay. And then the other part of the day, I might be in a heel. Mm -hmm. I love high heels. I've worn high heels my whole adi adult life. Yep. The higher, the better. Have not been wearing them as much in the pandemic. Because right. why? And so I need to like build up my stamina for heels. I, and I have no stamina. I hate heels. I don't like wearing them. I wear them literally on, like this is the secret guys. I wear them on set and as soon as I leave, I'm in the slippers. Yeah, slippers. I wore heels for the first time when I was here like last week. Oh yeah. I wore them for a couple of hours and they were killing me. Aww. And so just know everyone, if you're sort of wanting to get back to heels because you like them, they're pretty, okay. um, don't go a full day. You have to sort of build up the muscles again. You have to get your foot back in shape. And I these days am a lot more interested in a quality heel yes that's not a fast fashion situation no something, something you invest in that you invest in I, I don't need crazy designer nope. but I do want something that's really well made so this is a brand M Jemmy they're a little bit of an investment okay. but they're handcrafted they're Italian Ooh. this is the kind of shoe that you have for a really long time I'm gonna try it on. and you get it resold and you just break it in and it gets comfortable and more comfortable. Actually, uh, upon first ap application of yeah. the foot, it is already comfortable. You can really tell a well-made shoe. It does help wow. make it a lot more comfortable. And as you're kind of getting back into shoes and breaking them in, maybe you're gonna need two things. One, this is new skin liquid band-aid. I love liquid band-aid. So you band -aid. put this on before you have a blister anywhere you okay. think might rub. And then this on the heel. And then these band-aids, the Hydro Seal blister band-aids are, are the best when you get a blister. You, you are the best, Dars. Thank you Thank so you. much for bringing these wonderful things to us. This is very valuable to know. We are grateful for you. Thank you. We'll do a men's shoe segment too because the men will talk about that. All right. What are you doing next week? All right. <laughs>